think we missed the awards. We're gonna miss everything. What's Vicky doing here in public with Sloan Carpenter? <clears throat> Vicky, I, I, I'm sorry we got held out. You didn't miss much except the agony of my defeat. You didn't win? No. Who won? Lindsay Butler. Well, let's hope the food was good. Uh, best forgotten. Oh. What, uh, excuse me. Can I speak to you for just a minute? Sure. Thanks. Excuse me. So, what held you up? Oh, we exercise, and then we uh, grabbed a little something. What's going on here, Vicky? What are you doing here with Sloan, and why is Clint here with Lindsay? Did I miss something? Or, you know, like your divorce? It's not final, Bo, but it is in the works, yes. And as far as Lindsay's concerned, uh, I expect that Clint has probably made the same decision that I made to get on with my life. Couldn't you at least wait till the ink's dry? This wasn't easy for me tonight. I'm sorry. I know it isn't. It's just... It, it's really a shock to walk here in here and see you all like this. I'm sorry. I really am sorry, I should have been here earlier. Dorian got pretty drunk. Made an unusually nasty scene even for her. Well, that's fine. I'm sure you needed that. Well, I can handle Dorian. What I would never be able to deal with is losing you as a friend. I know it's going to be very awkward because your brother and I are separated, but I love you, Beau. I always have. And I really would like to remain a part of your family. What the hell were you doing over here talking to Vicky and Sloan? What do you mean? What do I mean? We're family, Bo. That's what I mean. I was hoping that you might be, at least while I'm going through this divorce, just a little bit loyal, you know, to your own flesh and blood. Yeah. Well, congratulations again. Thanks. Good night. Good night. Well, what do you want to celebrate? Uh, hey, I'm a working girl. I think I get, uh, get the sack pretty soon. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. You just won a major award. I'm not taking you home until we've had at least one dance somewhere. Name it. All right, then. The Waterside Inn. You got it. Let's go. I gather Clint was angry at you for talking to Vicky. <laughs> How'd you guess? Well, I'm a divorcee myself. Don't forget. I know the drill. The important thing is, don't choose sides. That's the most painful part. Yeah, I know. I've been through it myself. I've had any number of friends going through it, not to mention Asa and Renee. Mm -hmm. Just be careful, that's all. Thanks. So, where now? Um, it's getting kind of late. And since I'm almost home... I was kind of hoping maybe you'd invite me up for, like, a, a nightcap or... Well, I... I would. But Rachel's out of town, and I don't know whether I should risk it being alone with you. You know what my vote is? What? You should go ahead and risk it all. I sure as hell would. All right. Well, would you come up to my suite? I thought we agreed that you liked me. I do. It's my technique. Oh, no. It's wonderful. Your technique is wonderful. It's me. No, no, there's nothing wrong with you or your technique, counselor. Believe me. I hate to jump to any uh, hasty judgments. Maybe we ought to try it again. Oh, no. Okay. Did I do something wrong? No. No, you've done nothing wrong. Oh, God, I wish this evening would never end. Who says it has to end? I do. I do. I do. Oh, God, I wish you could stay the night. I accept. No, you can't. Not tonight, Bo. You really can't. You see, call me old-fashioned or call me just plain scared. I just, I need to go a little slower. I see. Am I pressuring you? Am I, you, you, feel, you feel uncomfortable about no. what? You, no, if anything, you've been, you've been tender and gentle and... And kind, and I'm doing everything I can not to just throw you down on this oriental rug and just make mad, passionate love to I you. I think that'd be great. I'm really partial to orientals. No, I have to be mature. Oh. Someone has to be mature and responsible. Oh. 
When the time comes for us to make love, we both have to be very sure. It can't be casual with me, Bo. What, do you, you think it's casual with me? No, I'm just... I'm worried that you're trying too hard, that you're, you're being too intense and too soon, and it's because of... Okay, no, I know, I know. Go ahead. Go ahead and say it. It's because of uh, Sarah. Because there was such a long time that I was trying to, uh, I don't know what, escape from the pain that I felt by losing her, and that time's passed, Nora. I don't think it has yet, Bo. I know it has. Look, you, you say that you want to take time, that we'll know when the time is right for, for us. Trust me, I am sure right now, I'm not trying to, to use you to, to help me forget about Sarah. I want you for you. Just you. Oh, God. I want to believe that more than anything. Okay, fine, then let me prove it to you. By saying goodnight. I mean, uh, if I was really that desperate, could I take no for an answer? Ah, I can wait. But I'll come back. And back, and back, and back, and back, and back, until you change that no into yes. <laughs>